Airway obstructions occur when small pieces or fragments of crowns, derbits, or tooths are inhaled. There are three ways to prevent airway obstructions. They include the use of dental dams, use high volume suction, and placing a throat pack. Symptoms include gasping throat, ineffective cough, respiratory difficulty, high pitched breathing sound, and a change in color and other symptoms. Call for assistance. Help. Begin abdominal thrust. Since patient is in the chair, you do not have to alter telium. Mallor which they leave in the chair. If the object cannot be removed, call 911. The next medical emergency we will demonstrate is allergic reaction. Allergic reactions occur because of exposure to a certain antigen. There are two different types of allergic reactions that can occur in the dental office. They are handled in different ways. We will begin with demonstrating dermatitis allergic reactions. Dermatitis is an allergic reaction that results in irritation of skin. Symptom symptoms include itching, skin, red skin redness, or hives. What to do? Terminate treatment. Identify area of the rash. Monitor, monitor and record vital signs. Prepare and administer oral anesthesiment. Be prepared to administer initiate emergency response if patient goes unconscious. Refer the patient for medical consolation. The second type of allergic reaction that can occur in the dental is anaphylaxis. Anaphylaxis is a life-threatening allergic reaction. Symptoms include anaphylaxis, feeling ill, nausea, vomiting, shortness of breath, which could escalate to inability to breathe, irregular heartbeat, sudden drop in blood pressure. What to do? Terminate treatment. Activate emergency response and call 911. Hey, what's Place patient in supine position. Administer oxygen, EpiPen, and thigh. Monitor and record vitals until EMS arrives. If patient becomes unconscious, start CPR. Are you The last medical emergency we will demonstrate is asthma attack. Asthma is a pulmonary disorder characterized by attacks of sudden onset breathing problems during which the patient's airway is narrow. Symptoms include coughing, wheezing, increased anxiety, blue appearance of nails, increased pulse rate is also a symptom. What to do? Call for assistance. Can we, can I get your help over here? Place the patient upright. Have patient self-medicate with inhaler. Minister oxygen as needed. Monitor and record vitals. If asthma does not respond to the inhaler treatment, call 911. Now we will demonstrate the dental emergency of oral hemorrhage. Dental hemorrhage can be due to the medication Coumadin or post-op oral surgery. Post-op instructions for oral surgery.
place gauze at extraction site until bleeding stops. If bleeding persistent, place a tea bag on site. Tea contains tannic acid, which can assist with the clotting process. Refrain from smoking, using a straw, or spitting. Act like the patient just had extraction and bleeding will not stop. If bleeding is persistent, it is recommended to call EMS. You should follow up with the patient within 24 hours after they leave to ensure that the bleeding had stopped.